Welcome back Kia owners, and for those of you that have never been here before, welcome to my channel. While we have a moment here, don't forget to check out my other Kia DIY repair videos. Just click above on the right hand corner, it'll take you there. But before we get started, please don't forget to like and subscribe, and don't forget to hit that bell. Believe it or not, this really helps me to continue making these videos. Welcome ladies and gentlemen. Well today I'm going to show you how to replace your light bulb on your brake light. So if you step on your brakes and someone tells you or you notice that your brake light doesn't work on your driver's side, well watch this video. And if your bulb is bad, only cost about two or three bucks to replace it and a simple screwdriver. From what I understand, this will work also on a 2014 through 2019. So. What I'm going to show you is going to work through those years. So let's get to work. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to pop open the hatch. You're going to go to the passenger side and you're going to look for four screws. One here. One just below this piston. Another one above it. And one on the very top corner. You're going to remove those four Phillips screws. I'll speed it up here. Once you have the four screws removed, if you have one of these tools that removes the door panels, it'll probably be a little more convenient. If you have a butter knife, it'll work probably just as well. Use this tool only in the area where the screws were at. Just come up underneath and it should pop loose. Once we have that loose, now we can pull the light backwards. On the right side, there's about three pins that it connects to. Just pull it out, it'll pop right out. Doesn't take much effort. You can see where I'm pointing here, the three points on the lens where it snaps into the body here at these three points. Now we're gonna lay the lens down. I don't need to unplug it, but if you feel that you need to unplug the lens, right where the red arrow's at, that's where you unplug it. But I'm gonna leave mine plugged in. Now, if you notice, this is the bottom of the lens, right where the red arrow's at. And the next arrow up is pointed to the light bulb that needs to be changed. So all you have to do is just grab it counterclockwise and turn it a quarter of a turn. Should come loose. You may have a little trouble to get it out because the wires are very taut, at least on mine, but you could get it out. Once you got it out, same thing with the light bulb, just slightly push in and turn a quarter of a turn counterclockwise and that light bulb should pop right out. Now that we got the old bulb out, let's replace it with the new one. The same thing, just do it in reverse, push it in and turn a quarter of a turn clockwise. Do the same thing as you're putting the fixture into the lens. Once you have the bulb in, now let's go ahead and install the lens back in. Once you have it in position, make sure you push on the outside of the lens so you get those three pins that are on the back of the lens snap into the body holes. You can see as I push back, you'll hear it snap. There you go. All right, once you've got it snapped in, go ahead and put the four screws in. I'm going to go ahead and fast forward here. Once you got the last screw in, you're pretty much done. All you need to do now is just go in the front of the vehicle, step on the brakes, have somebody look and make sure that the light comes on, and you're good. See how easy that was? Okay, well I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope it was very informative. Please check out my other how-to videos. Oh, and check out my new website. There's new items being put in there every day. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and of course, hit the bell. Until then, we'll see you at my next video. Bye!